Hello everyone, this is Yadik Reddy. Welcome to my channel HVR Tutorials. If you are interested in learning more about automation testing with different programming languages and tools, please visit my channel. If you haven't subscribed my channel yet, please subscribe it right now and press the bell icon to get a notification whenever I upload a new video. In the last video we have seen how to install Flyu Inspector. So in this video we'll see how we can inspect the elements using Flyu Inspector. For inspecting any application, FlyUI is providing three modes. Mode is nothing but a way of inspecting the element. So it is providing three ways for inspecting any application. So now we'll see what are those three ways and how we can use those three ways. So let me open my FlyUI inspect tool. So it is asking me to choose the version. For now I am choosing UIA3 version. So here you can see. In my Flyo inspect application UI, I have a tab called mode. So when you click on that, you will see three modes available there. So the first one is hover mode, next focus tracking, next show X path. Now we'll see how we can use each of these mode in detail. First, I'm going with hover mode. So for hover mode, in the brackets, you can see use control. So when you wanted to work with hover mode, you have to use control key from your keyboard. So first, let me select hover mode. So for showing a demo, I'm opening a sample application that is calculator. So here I have the calculator. So from this, I wanted to inspect one button. So using this hover mode, first you have to press your control key. Then you have to focus on the target element. So for example, just like this. So I pressed my control key. Then I moved my mouse pointer to the target element that is one. So in the fly inspect tool, you can see one is selected. So first let me tell you how this fly inspect tool will show you the information. So this fly inspect tool will have two panels. So the left panel and right panel in the left panel, it will show the selected element. That means whatever the element that we are targeting and we have inspected. And for the selected element, the available information, it will be shown in the right panel. So please remember that left panel always shows the selected element and your right panel shows the selected elements information. Here you can see button one is selected and it is showing the information related to button one. The name is one like that. So for example, if I select button zero, you can see the right panel is also updated. So the right panel is showing the information for button zero. So this is how we need to use the hover mode. In hover mode, whenever you want to inspect any element, you have to press your control key in the keyboard and focus your mouse cursor on the target element. Then the element will be inspected. So now I'm unchecking this one. So the next mode is focus tracking how this focus tracking will work when you select focus tracking you don't need to press any control or any other key in your keyboard all you have to do is focus on the target element so once you focus on the target element the element will be selected and the information will be displayed in fly inspect tool for example now what we will do is under this view menu we will inspect any menu item like programmer so first i will select focus tracking mode then you can see here wherever I am focusing the respective element is selected so when I focus on statistics the statistics is selected programmer scientific so this is how the focus tracking will work the programmer is selected and you can see the information of the programmer menu item in the right side panel so this is the second mode that is focus tracking I am unchecking this focus tracking mode the third mode is show X path so how this show X path will work Whenever you select the show X path mode, so this show X path will show you the X path of the particular selected element. So where it will show. So in this fly you inspect tool on the bottom one panel is there. So here it will show you the X path for the selected element. So I'm selecting show X path and for inspecting the show X path will show you the selected element X path, but it will not inspect the element. So for inspecting, we have to use either hover mode or focus tracking. So I'm going with hover mode. I selected hover mode. I'm inspecting one button here. So you can see in the fly you inspect tool button one is selected and in the bottom panel, it is showing the X path. So if you wanted to copy this X path, you can select this X path from here and right click, click on copy. So this is how show X path will work. So please remember that this show X path will show only absolute X path. It will not show you the relative X path. So if you wanted to write relative X path, you can follow the X path standards and you can write your own relative X path. So that's it guys. I hope you enjoy this session. 
if you like this video please hit the like button and also share it with your friends thanks for watching bye bye